Welcome to Orange Picks. In this fast-changing world we live in, sometimes choosing which TV series to watch can be a bit complicated, right? But don't worry, because today we're going to help you find the right one for you. This is a free guide designed to start a journey through the world of TV, and when you watch this video all the way to the end you will surely find the next big show you want to watch. Now, grab your cup of tea, coffee or snacks and relax. We're exploring the best TV series you can start watching right now, Delivery on 30? Yeah, sign in. Sure, you might hold on to that for me, thanks. That is a bomb. I have just armed it. Don't move. You move the bomb detonates. If I hear any alarms or sirens, I detonate the bomb, understand? Good. Rabbit Hole is a spy drama series centered on Special Agent James Weir, who works to protect democracy in a world of misinformation, behavior manipulation, and surveillance. My favorite part of the series was the realistic treatment of the grieving process for the characters Becca and Howie. Both characters choose different ways to cope with a painful event and this process is emotionally impressive to the audience. The show's IMDb score of 7.4 proves its quality. Absolute trust in the plan. This is gonna hurt. Ambassador Catherine Wyler, Prime Minister Nicole Trowbridge. Welcome. Sir, it's an honor to meet you. Ah, honor to be met. <laughs> Someone is luring a strike force into the Persian Gulf. The Diplomat is a series that tells the story of a career diplomat who, in the midst of an international crisis, takes a high-profile job for which she is not suited. Kate Weiler is appointed as the United States Ambassador to the United Kingdom. However, the task is not as easy as Kate expected. My favorite part of the series was the development of Kate's character. At the beginning, Kate is a woman who feels inadequate and feels that she is not up to the task. But as the series progresses, Kate becomes fun and a quick decision maker. I would like to speak to the Secretary of State, please. I've kept my mouth shut for 25 years. I don't know what you're expecting. Now that you're back, I'm expecting adequate compensation. Tulsa. What's Tulsa? Tulsa King is a series about former New York mob boss Dwight Monfredi, known as The General, who has just been released from prison after 25 years in prison and is exiled to Tulsa, Oklahoma, where he tries to build a new criminal empire. Tulsa King is a quality series that blends crime, drama, and thriller genres. If you find such topics interesting, I highly recommend you to watch it. The series has an IMDb score of 8.0 and I think it definitely deserves to be watched. Nah, there's no such a thing. Is this a one-off? Or one of many? Too soon to tell. We're born into a certain world. It's chosen for us. Gangs of London is a crime, detective, and thriller series about the struggles between rival gangs and other criminal organizations in modern-day London. The Wallace family, London's most powerful crime family, is shaken when their leader Finn Wallace is assassinated. Finn's son Sean takes his father's place and tries to take control of the family's business. However, this situation causes London's other criminal organizations to take action. The series has an IMDb score of 8.1. <laughs> You can build an empire. You can be a king. Hijack is a thriller series about the hijacking of a plane from Dubai to London by terrorists and the aftermath. Flight K-29 is hijacked during its seven-hour journey from Dubai to London. Taking the passengers and crew hostage, the terrorists demand a ransom of $100 million. Sam Nelson, a successful business negotiator on board, tries to use his professional skills to save the lives of the passengers. But his high-risk strategy could lead him to disaster. Hijack is a breathtaking thriller with a successful plot. It's either us or them. I can tell you, it's not gonna be us. I've done for my children. I know I've made mistakes, but I've always tried to do the best by them because I love them.
Succession is an impressive series that is one of the best examples of the family drama genre. Following the death of Logan Roy, the owner of media giant Waystar Royco, the series tells the story of his family's struggle to take control of the company. The comedy elements in unexpected moments also increase the long-term watchability of the series. With an 8.9 IMDb score, you should definitely not miss this almost record-breaking series. Who's in charge right now? You are a fucking nobody. I, I don't normally do these kind of speeches, but this feels like a big moment. Slow Horses is an espionage series in which Me5 sends failed agents to a rubbish department called Slough House. These agents have made career-ending mistakes or fallen from grace. The Slough House team, led by Jackson Lamb, is assigned to solve a kidnapping. The case jeopardizes Me 5E's reputation. The second season of this series about espionage and unrevealed events was also very successful. The characters and stories loved in the first season continued in the second season. Yeah, no, I think they're a bunch of absolute losers. But they're my losers. Think you can take me on? That's the wrong question. Oh yeah? What's the right one? <laughs> Do you really want to find out? Warrior is an action and drama series set in 19th century San Francisco in Chinatown, a neighborhood of Chinese immigrants. Ah Sam is a young fighter who comes to San Francisco from China. While trying to find his brother Ah Toy, who lives in Chinatown, he meets the dark side of the city. As Ah Sam tries to balance the power-struggling gangs in Chinatown, he fights against Long Zi, one of the most dangerous men in the city. If you like martial arts and fast-paced action, this is the series for you. How are you finding America so far? What's it like? Always knowing the truth. There's nothing mystical about it. I could just tell. When anyone is lying. Yeah. Next up is the incredibly funny Poker Face. This is a comedy drama series in which Charlie Kale, who can tell when someone is lying, uses this ability to solve crimes around the world. In particular, the humorous aspect of the show was quite successful. Charlie's jokes and humor as he uncovers the lies managed to make the audience laugh. Also, the crime elements of the series were quite gripping. Charlie solving a different crime in each episode keeps the audience in suspense. The second season of the series was also approved. I can't wait to see how Charlie's story will continue in the new season. It's crazy. You ever gamble because you can make a killing? <laughs> nah. If you are tired of searching for the best movie, why don't you put me to work for you? Let me do the work for you and pick the best from every genre every week. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. It's great to work for you. Jimmy! Liz! Hey! It's three in the morning. I'm sorry. What's in that bowl? Pretzels. The other bowl. Maybe some painkillers. Maybe? There's painkillers in there, yeah. Shrinking is a delightful comedy drama series that tells the story of a therapist who begins to be more honest and open with his clients after the death of his wife. Jimmy Laird is a successful therapist. However, his life is turned upside down after the death of his wife. Jimmy tries to suppress his feelings about her death, but this forces him to be more honest and open with his clients. In the process, Jimmy also begins to rediscover his own life. Jimmy sparked back. You just gonna leave your car here? I'm a white guy in Pasadena. The cops will probably just take it back to my house for me. Must be nice. Thank you for being with us today. It was great to review the best television series to start watching right away and I hope this list has helped you. If you like this video, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. If you would like to contribute more to our channel, you can buy a cup of coffee by clicking the join button. This helps us to produce more quality content. Anyway, thank you very much for being here with us. Don't forget that we will be back with more great TV series and movie recommendations. We wish you all a wonderful day!